So let me show you my analysis on the SPM Biology 2023. Hey guys, welcome back. This is CSGO Biology, long time no see. Today, I'm going to show you my analysis on SPM Biology 2023. I know you guys are waiting for this and I have got your back. So before I show you the analysis, remember to click like and subscribe to my channel as I will post more trial papers discussions in the near future. Now, currently the Excel file that you guys are seeing right now is actually my analysis on biology SPM 2022. Now, I just want to see whether my analysis is accurate or not. Now, based on what I have shown you in the previous video for the analysis, this is the questions that came out a lot in the previous trial papers. Now, we have the cell organizations, cell respiration, xylem and flowworm, transportation of water and nutrients, immunity, and so on and so on. Now, this is the number that came out in the trial paper for this topic. Let's say we have a five here besides the variations. It means that the variations came out in the trial papers for five times. All right. Now, on the left side, we have the topics that came out in the SPM 2022. The topic that is highlighted in yellow is the topic that actually came out in the SPM 2022. For example, we have the enzyme came out in SPM 2022 and enzyme is one of my predicted topics. The rest like immunity, vital hormone, plant oxygen, meiosis non-disjunctions, meiosis and non-disjunctions, all right, variations. All these questions actually quite similar to our previous analysis. So is this method working? Let's try it to find out this year, all right? So let me show you my analysis on the SPM Biology 2023. So there you go, guys. This is the analysis Biology 2023. Now, look at this one. I have listed out all the paper two questions from different states, and these are the result. okay? There are a lot here, question one to question 11. Okay, so this is the questions. Put them into my analysis table. What you guys can see here is, Inheritance actually came out 12 times in the trial papers. So what you guys can see here is the questions like schematic diagram ask you to write down the gametes, offspring, and then the karyotypes. Seems like very popular for this time. So make sure you guys know how to draw the schematic diagrams, know the formats, and then do a lot of this kind of questions here. This is all the papers, okay, that you guys can see. Turner syndrome, thalassemia, and so on. So besides schematic diagram, the disease like sickle cell anemia is also seems like quite popular for this time, right? So last time, okay, for the SPM in 2022, Down syndrome is quite popular. But this time, sickle cell anemia is quite popular. So make sure you guys know what is a sickle cell anemia. So you guys can actually see some sickle cell anemia questions right here. It's the 10 marks questions. And then there's another sickle cell anemia questions here also, okay, from the trial papers and so on. So make sure you guys know what is a sickle cell anemia. Now, next one, Mendel laws. Now, for Mendel laws, we have two laws, Mendel first law and also the Mendel second law. So make sure you guys know what is the meanings of the Mendel first and the second law. All right, the next one is the digestions and diet. For this digestions and diet, it came out 10 times in the trial papers, talking about the enzyme and also the organ structure. Organ structure, for example, like what kind of enzyme that the stomach will produce, what kind of food that the stomach will digest, the gallstone, gallbladder, the liver produce the bowel, and so on. All these things you guys need to go through. Lah. For the digestions, this topic is actually a big topic. It can come out in the sections A for paper two, or the section C in the paper two. Okay, so you guys need to get ready for all these kind of questions. Huh? Now, for example, you look at this, okay, structure P, the stomach, the structure uh, Q, which is the liver, what is the function, what is the enzyme they produce. Yeah, all these things are quite popular for this time. So let's go through all the paper questions here. You can see gallbladder, gallstones again, gallbladder again. Stama, parietal cell. This is the villus, small intestine. Stama. And we actually have a lot of this kind of questions. Now get ready for these kind of questions. Now next one, human reproductions and the plants reproductions are. For human reproductions, for example, like the 
menstrual cycle or the spermatogenesis came out five times in the trial papers and then for the plants reproductions like double fertilization came out four times in the uh, trial papers now for the human reproductions the most important part is actually the four types of the hormones for example like the fsh progesterone the LH and also the estrogen. These four hormones, make sure you guys know what is their functions, uh, what is their important roles in the menstrual cycle, the process. Okay, maybe I can show you some of the sample questions. Now, look at this. Okay, so this is talking about the four hormones. They will show you a graph like this. Then probably you guys need to state uh, between day zero to day five, what kind of hormones will be produced and so on. Yeah. Twins. Yeah, twins also very popular. Okay, for this time, twins, and then the again the four types of hormone: FSH, LH, estrogens, and also progesterone. Growth phase. Let's continue to look at the questions here. Spermatogenesis. Okay, talking about the sperm. Yeah, hormone again. The role of hormone in the menstrual cycle. And a lot, a lot. Okay, so make sure you guys go through all these questions before your SPM. Huh? If you guys haven't watched my video yet for this topic, maybe you guys can try to study by using my video that talking about the chapter 15 reproductions in humans. Yeah, I'm sure that video will help you a lot in terms of the hormones and their function. Now, next, environment. Environment is a very popular topic which will come out in the section C, question 11. Okay, last time in SPN 2022, the question 11 came out global warming, eutrophications, and green technology. Last year, global warming, eutrophication, green technology came out. This year, this kind of question can come out again also, but less likely. So whether you guys want to study all these things or not, my suggestion is, Yes, you need to go and study everything here. So this is just the analysis for you to refer. So even though all these topics are listed out here, you still need to go and study the whole textbook, okay? Form 4 and Form 5 syllabus. Because you want to get A+, plus, right? If you want to, want to get A+, plus, you still need to study everything, sir. Huh? Now, environment, okay? Global warming, eutrophication, green technology. Let's go and read through it. Huh? Now, for the next one is the xylem and flow worm transportation of water and nutrients, translocation, transpiration, all these topics never came out in SPN 2022. Like the transportation of water from the roots to the leaf is the topic you guys need to focus more. All right, so yeah, these are the questions. You guys can see xylem, flow worm, okay, labeling, the structure, the roots, xylem and flow worm, Yeah, these kind of topics are quite popular. Now, the next question is like the respiratory system. For example, like the gaseous exchange, respiratory system, like in the humans, in the insect or the animals, you guys need to go through as well. The question will come out something like this. Okay, talking about the emphysema, talking about how the fish get the oxygen, bronchus bronchitis, our human respiratory system, okay, alveolus, the respiratory system, the tracheal system in the inside. Okay, how we breathe in the air and breathe out the air. So these kind of questions need to go and study. Okay, next one, sound and organization. This time, uh, sound and organization, they came out a lot like the paramecium and also the amoeba living processes. The questions like this could come out in your SPM. Okay, so you guys can see, this is the paramecium and we have the contractor vacuole. Make sure you guys know what is the contractor vacuole and you guys know the paramecium. They are actually living in the fresh water. All right. So let me show you more. Um, paramecium again. This is the oral groove. Basically, this is their mouth and then they can eat something by using their mouth. So plant sound. Okay. Mitochondrion. All this topic can be the first questions of your sections A, paper 2. Okay. Now, next one, nervous system. Nervous system like reflex arc and also the synapse. You guys need to take note a bit because last year 
this kind of question didn't come out in the SPM. Huh? Maybe we can look at the examples here. There you go. Reflex arc. Reflex arc. Fight or flight. Synapse. Reflex arc. Endocrine system and so on synapse again you can see all these questions uh synapse again okay reflex arc fight or flight so what you guys can see there are a lot of fight or flight situation also so you guys need to study the fight or flight situation also uh. make sure you know what is the hormone that involved in the fight or flight situations and what kind of uh, effect when the adrenaline release okay next one variations Variations last time, okay, came out a lot in the question 10. The SPM question talked about the discontinuous variations, independence of Solomon, Down syndrome, and also the GMO, genetically modified organism. So probably the variations will be less popular when it comes to this year, SPM. Now, next one, photosynthesis, especially compensation point. Example of questions, like, as you can see, compensation point, okay. This is the photosynthesis reactions, light reactions, and also the uh, dark reactions. Talking about the leaf structure, yeah, that one also very important. Huh? Compensation point, compensation point. Yeah. Now, that's all for the trial people's questions. So you guys need to focus more on this uh, compensation point, and then also the leaf structure, where I put my leaf structure, yeah, over here. So you guys can talk about the leaf structure as well. For example, like the palisade mesophysal or the spongy mesophysal, right? Last year, SPM question 8 came out meiosis and non-disjunctions. So, mitosis will be more likely to come out in the SPM. Uh, mitosis you can talk about the cancer, talk about the karyotypes, talk about the, the process of the mitosis. Or maybe the cell cycle as well, okay? It, Tissue culture, yeah. Tissue culture also related to the mitosis, yeah. Okay. Ask you to draw the uh, chromosome inside the cell. So you guys need to know how to draw it, draw it as well. All right. So anyway, cell division is still a very, very important topic in biology. So a lot of topics, they are related to the uh, form 4 chapter 6 mitosis and meiosis so you guys need to master this topic for SPM biology all right guys next one skeleton and muscle skeleton and muscle for example like the endogenistic muscle okay for the birds one for the humans one for the fish one yeah you guys need to go and study this is like recap osteoporosis or sclerosis you guys need to also look into it now the rest like the enzyme food chain biodiversity and tropism they came out only three times in your trial papers yeah for example like enzyme and lock and key which came out in SPN 2022 question 2 enzyme so these are our questions yeah you guys can go and study a little bit food chain biodiversity okay these two question probably can combine and ask you something like the energy pyramids or maybe talking about the kingdom for example like this kind of questions yeah Mm -hmm. so you guys can see okay the interactions between the organisms talking about the mangrove swamp yeah all this food chain possible to come out in your exam yeah okay now last one tropism tropism came out last year which is uh question six phytohormones and also tropism so tropism you guys need to go through it as well now guys, that's all for the analysis. As I mentioned before, this is just the analysis. All of us, we don't have the dark magic. We cannot predict the future. We cannot see the questions in the SPM. So guys, this could be accurate or not accurate. All these questions here could come out in your SPM or maybe will not come out in your SPM questions. So what are you guys still watching this video? Go and study lah, okay? Study the whole textbook to get your A+. All right, guys, I'll see you guys around. Go study, go, 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 go.